Okay, so hopefully you like um, what you have seen. You're not offended. Um, you see, I will not make post the statements such as this. I'm not. Facebook had by clamor of my persecuting family and my persecuting neighbors and not for their clamor Facebook would not take away from me over 3,861 friends and that includes also videos 167 and because my enemies have clamored YouTube to take that down and so I call a night demand for justice I don't make enemies here because I make trouble no it's not in my not as bragging but you know that my nature is being diagnosed with mild ADHD being bullied uh, what rather makes them much angry about me is because I dance and because I'm you see just looking out for some intrusions for my family as you know um, they hate that I dance and they're, they're using that as well as my being diagnosed with ADHD there really abusing my mental health and being so depressed and on the verge of committing suicide you see amongst those 3861 friends that um, censors had taken away from me is lady alicia reynolds lady to admit I make friends with people that are of the same interest as me. That is the essence of making friends. You introduce yourself to people you don't know, but you want to make friends with those people because you share interests. So that's how I got you on my first, second Facebook accounts. I explain this because I would not have a second and third Facebook had not my family you see my first Facebook was gone because they were demanding that they conform uh, they, they make me conform to what they want but in religion I changed religion because I saw that my previous religion was abusive and my family unfortunately but stuck to it they don't want me to change religion they want me to stay the same religion as them to admit um, had not some of my family but on that religion they uh, had influenced me to join that and in turn I had influenced the rest of my family to join it but later on the religion became abusive and I had no idea that when I joined that religion, it would turn out to be abusive. And we were staying too long in that religion that my, the rest of my family was stuck. They were blinded. And they don't want to change religion. And they saw that the religion that we joined was abusive. I was the first to, to come out of that religion in our family. But my family would not allow me. And they offered me... Uh, this temptation that I will stay the same religion as theirs or they will take away from me my first Facebook account I chose to get out of my religion and so they had taken down my first Facebook not because I hate my friends that I chose to get out of that religion They scared me um, they asked me to give them the contact to my account 
password and they treacherously see, treacherously hacked down my first account even though I was trying after they had offered me that trip to conform to them little by little because I hope I could still save my friends. It was really a big mistake. Being diagnosed with ADHD, I think, has really affected my thinking and I had made very wrong decisions, worst decisions, including that. Not because I hate you. Of course, I could spend all the, my time saying I don't hate you, but it's still a wrong decision. I made a second account, then you still joined in, and then my cyber bullies had taken it down too. So I made a third account, but you have rejected me. Why? I understand that you find me first, you don't know me, second, when we were on our second Facebook, again, my ADHD well, ex could really use all my time excusing my ADHD, but I'm very sorry I repent that I had poor judgment. I had cost many friends just because I'm asking nonsense questions, too curious, too asky, but, but I don't do it because I want to offend you, I want to annoy you, no. Because somehow, halfly, I fear that if we are not interacting with each other, you will find me too inactive. So I ask questions. I say, how do you do? How are you? And I think, I think it would be offensive for you. I just say, how are you? How do you do? And then you would think, oh, who are you for me to ask that? Had we know each other already? So just keep quiet. And when I say, how do you do? How are you doing? Then you say, yes. it's my fear too. Lapse of healthy judgment. I'm fighting to take back those counts, those videos. But I know I had to make reparation. I had, I think I had paid too much for my sins. In the spirit of true Christian charity, Lady Alicia Reynolds and your entire family, I humbly offer myself for your forgiveness. I fear I know, I fear that there is this reality that sins can be forgiven, but blessings can be lost. I had lost it for the past five years. I'm sorry, I repent. I humble myself. Please, pardon me. There are no words for me to ask for your forgiveness and not only for your forgiveness but also for the forgiveness of everyone whom I am annoyed, annoyed with my lapse of judgment. Too many of them. Emilia Danilovna, Anna Vdovic, Maria Kosoni, Maya Makatali, all of you. Please believe me, you can trust me, help me take back my account. I promise you, if you help me campaign to Facebook and YouTube to get back my account, and that means we will be friends again, I ask your forgiveness. You could trust me, and I promise you, I will not annoy you any longer. I will not ask any questions any longer. Just please, be my friend again. Help me get back with you. Help me pay forward to you as much as I can. Some time I will see to it that I will give you proper tribute of Thanksgiving as much as I can. I will give you anything you want to. Anything you require, just please 
Don't shut me up. Don't block me. Don't unfriend me. I will just stay as a quiet friend, supportive, loyal friend. Just please don't un don't block me. Just unblock me. Don't hinder me. Please believe me. Forgive me. I'm sorry. You can see all my videos. You can see for yourself what I'm doing. And I'm not trolling you. I'm not making any evil intentions against you. I'm only human. Call me a devil. Call me a demon. I so believe. But all I have done for the past five years. I'm truly a devil. I'm truly a demon. But please, don't shut me up. Help me take back my account. Okay, trust me, my family has been hindering me from pursuing my dance dreams. And I can only rely on people like you to be my family. God bless you. I love and respect you very much. Thank you for your trust, for your forgiveness. Please accept me again as your own. I miss you. Save me. Don't let me die. If you want me to die, kill me. It will be the greatest honor for me. Come here and kill me. Love and respect you very, very much. And I die for your pleasure. 